Harvest 99 was both the hardest physically and most exhilarating uh, uh, gustatorily that I've ex experienced that I've ever had. Patrice Rion came from, he was running his family's winery in Louis Saint-Georges, Domaine d'Enriel Rion et Fils. They're a huge winery, 25 hectares. They made 30 different wines. So I started off uh, being just, you know, manual labor. I did not pick, I worked in the winery. But for the first 10 days, all I did was, with a pitchfork, shovel grape stems after, out of the destemmer into the back of a truck for 10 days. For 10 days. <laughs> but anyway, uh, what happened was that we went through the whole process. I learned how physical uh, the winemaking process is, uh, how, uh, how much attention to detail you need to, to pay through each step of the process. And then at the end of it, once we'd put all the wine in barrels, the fermentations were done, everything was done, Patrice said, now you, you've been here through the whole process. You've watched, you've seen, every grape that comes into this place is treated differently. It's treated the same, excuse me. Uh, they were all been farmed the same. You've seen, you've participated in the vinification. They're all vinified the same. They're all put in the same barrels. Now let's go downstairs and taste them. And I tasted these new wines and there were 30 different wines there. And Patrice said, that's the magic of Burgundy. And he was right. I tasted 30 different expressions of the earth via the medium of Pinot Noir. Well, we bought a house uh, in 2002, knowing we were gonna move in 2003. So we arrived having a house to move into. And I again worked uh, the 2003 harvest for Patrice. He had by that time left his family domain and started up on his own. And be I began to learn how much I didn't know. <laughs> So the first thing I learned was that in order to be a wine grower in Burgundy, uh, you have to have a French qualification in viticulture and enology. I did not know this before I went, so immediately began looking for the coursework that I would have to do to, to get this. During this time, uh, I got offered my first parcel of vineyards, which was Corton Charlemagne. And when you get offered Corton Charlemagne, you don't say no. So I bought my per first parcel of vineyards at the same time that I was going to viticulture school and began farming as I was learning. I didn't know really how to do it, so at the same time as those two things, I signed on as a vineyard hand for Jean-Marc Pio in Chesson Maraché. This was in the summer of 2004, so I'd been there not quite a year yet, uh, and learned the viticulture by actually doing it at, at Jean-Marc's in Chessagne. What wine school was good for was showing me the range of choices that are available to a wine grower throughout every step of the process from pruning the vine to putting the, vine, the finished wine in barrel. So you, you know what's available to choose from depending on the style of wine you want to make. What I learned at Jean Marc's is how to grow ripe, healthy, balanced grapes because that's the secret of Burgundy.